Andy, well we heard from Amir Khan earlier on who was a guest of honour at the Bolton Lads and Girls Club over the weekend. The venue played host to its annual charity boxing night with the club's fighters once again taking on the army. Andy Ditton reports. There was no doubting that the army was in town as one of the most impressive youth clubs in the country had a military makeover for the night. It was only fitting as well that Bolton's most famous boxing son was guest of honour. This is our biggest fundraiser of the year. It's just a fantastic event. It's the boxing extravaganza and uh, we've got the, uh, the Royal Regiment of Fusiliers here to help us. Uh, they're pitting their wits against some of the best boxers from the North West. So we're going to have an absolutely cracking night. We've decked the club out. I don't know what it looks like. It's a cross between sort of um, Kabul and somewhere else. But there's sort of, uh, we've got cam nets everywhere and uh, machine gun turrets. And it's going to be an absolutely cracking night. We've got 300 black tie guests coming. We're hoping to raise about £80,000 for the club. And, uh, and of course, with that, we keep the club going for months and months and months and giving ordinary kids in Bolton somewhere great to come. So it's, it's hard work, it's good fun, but it's what the club's all about. It wasn't too long ago that Amir Khan was playing his boxing trade for the Bolton Lads and Girls Club himself. He's of course come a long way since then, but hasn't forgotten where it all began for him. It's um, Bolton Lads and Girls Club's show today and um, they're raising all the money for the, for the club. And it's for a good cause, that's the main thing, you know, it's going to keep so many kids off the streets. Um, so yeah, it's, a great, it's, great, it's for a good cause and I'm here to support, support the, the young fighters. You know, I was once an amateur. And it's good to come back and, you know, just because, my, you know, I've also boxed for a button as a girls' club. So, it's, you know, I can't, you can't forget your roots. You have to come back sometimes. Sadly, we haven't put enough money into youth centres in this country over the last 20, 25 years. And what clubs we have have sort of fallen a bit by the wayside. They get tired and tatty. And then they start opening one or two nights a week, which is no good. You know, young people deserve somewhere to go that's just excellent, top quality, cheap, affordable and open whenever kids want it. So we open seven nights a week, all day Saturday and Sunday. We charge 40 pence to come in, and every night the kids have got the choice of 20 different activities, great staff, and lo and behold, the club's packed. A night to remember then in Bolton, and we may even have seen a budding Amir Khan of the future. Andy Dickman, Channel Today. Thanks, Andy.